Hello everyone and welcome to this video tutorial of PrestaShop Payment Extra Fee Discount Module. In this video, I'll explain you the process to configure the module and I'll also show you that how you can charge extra fees or offer discounts on the payment methods that you are providing to your customers. So now let's just go to the PrestaShop back office to see the configuration of the module and the process to add uh, extra fees or offer discounts on the existing payment methods available to the customer. As you can see that I have already installed this my module uh, payment extra fee or discount in my PrestaShop. So let's just go to the configuration part. On clicking the configuration button, you will land on this manage payment fee page where you can uh, either create a plan for the uh, extra fees or for offering discount. In order to create a plan for extra fee or discount, you need to click on the add payment fee button. After that, you need to enter some details about the plan. Uh, enter details of the plan here. Uh, some description about that and uh, on which you want to add this particular uh, payment fee plan on which payment method select from here that is it will be on payment by check or on the bank transfer whatever the payment methods that are available on to your Presta shop all will be listed here what will be the priority of this plan in case if you wish to add multiple payment fee plan on a single payment method then how they will be applicable or applied on the uh, on the payment uh, method that you can set from here and that by priority in case if you wish to add two payment fee plans on a single payment method and if you set for priority for first one as one and second one as two then the priority given to the first one will be better because as you have set the priority one then next is whether you want to keep this payment fee as enabled or not you can always select uh, by enabling or disabling this status then there is next tab of conditions <coughs> here whether you are offering a discount or adding an extra fee you can always choose in order to offer a discount you need to enable this, this option and in case if you are adding extra fees then you need to disable this option what will be the minimum order amount to apply this uh, extra fees or offer discount or the maximum cart amount you can always select here then you can also restrict this payment fee plan or discount offer on the basis of multiple uh, options available here that is country or customer group or category manufacturer supplier whatever you want you can always choose to restrict on the basis of these available options then after filling in these details next comes a actions plan on applying a fee whether this will be a fee applied of a specified amount or it will be a percent of the total order amount or it will be a total percent and up on a specific amount what will be the options you can always choose from here in case if you wish to add a specific amount then click on the amount button and specify the amount in case of percent you can always choose to specify a certain percent of the order amount and in case of amount and percent you need to specify the fixed amount and the percent amount of the order that will be charged or offered as discount on the payment fee plan then there is next option of order amount this order amount is the maximum order amount uh, <coughs> uh, sorry this is the minimum order amount that will be uh, needed in order to apply discount offer this order amount has no as such applications in case of extra fee but while in case of adding a 
discount or offering a discount on a certain payment plan you need to specify this order amount so that on the basis of this minimum order amount value then only that discount offer can be applied now in order to explain you better let's just see one of the already payment fee plans that have been added to this PrestaShop as you can see uh, we have just explained the basic details of this plan then on this plan that is a payment by check method we are not offering any discount rather we are charging some extra fees but we have not uh, specified any minimum or maximum order amount for that uh, that means based on uh, order amount value whatever will be the amount value this extra fee will be charged from the customers then in this case we are applying a certain amount that is fixed amount of five dollars to the payment method in case if any customer chooses to pay by this particular payment by check method then five dollar of extra amount he will also need to pay apart from the order value that he has uh, created or the order value of the products that he has added into the cart then after the integration of the module uh, and another product is also added into the catalog section let's just take you there and explain that is this payment extra fee product this product has no as such feature of a common or a regular product that you add into your presta shop however it is needed to add extra fees but it has no as such impact while uh, uh, offering or any discount on the payment plans or payment fee that you are offering but you must take care of the fact that you don't delete this product as deleting of this product will uh, not allow you to add any extra fees on the uh, payment plans that you have on your presta shop however the discounts will be applicable as, as managed by you and your payment fee plans now this was all about the configuration and the addition of payment fee plans as extra fee or a discount. Now let's just go to the front office to see how this payment fee, uh, extra payment fee or a discount is offered on any payment plans while the customer selects or proceeds to pay via any specific payment method. As you can see, this is the checkout page. Uh, which the customer sees while ordering any product here as you can see this additional fee section information about the additional fee that is being charged by customer on paying via check is also available here in case if customer proceeds to pay via check then apart from the order value of uh, <coughs> this product that he has already added to the cart he will also need to add an extra of $5. As you can see that the order value, total order value of this product is only 53.98. However, the total uh, amount that is charged by the customer is 58.98. That is inclusive of this additional fee that is $5. Now let's just see another payment method on which we are already offering discount. As you can see, in case if a customer chooses to pay via pay by bank wire method then he will be offered a discount of 2.70 dollars this discount is in terms of percentage so the percent amount is calculated on the basis of total order amount so as you can see this total order amount is same as earlier that is 53.98 however after the application of discount the total amount which the customer here needs to pay is only 51.28 dollar so in this way you can always add an extra fees or offer a discount on using any particular payment method of your shop by your customer and uh, this was all about the process to configure the module and how you can uh, charge extra fees or offer discounts 
on using any particular payment method from your customer i hope this video helps you to configure and use the module in the best possible way thank you